street and there are little kids playing outside seeing me through the window probably like why is she smiling at her wall it's fine i wish i could go run around you smell really good all right hi guys today i'm gonna be doing a get ready with me makeup kind I don't know why I just can't speak. I couldn't, I just, I don't know. See, okay, anyway, I apologize for lighting. It is evening now, and um, if I put those on, I would look yellow, which I do need to take those down because I feel like it's very young, you know? I don't know, maybe, maybe not, let me know. Oh, I also wanted to mention I did kind of switch around my room so what the background does look different than before I hope you guys like that um, I just moved my desk from in front of the window to my wall because I got a mirror a really nice mirror hanging up and um, I just I don't know I just got something new and wanted to switch everything else around so that is what I did I put my TV here yeah, I don't know. My room's not like a big room or this really nice room, so I'm not gonna show you it. Um, but it's cute for me. <laughs> so I might be going out tonight, so I figured I would film me getting ready makeup wise. My hair is not nice. I just did it half up, half down. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine convincing myself. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy watching me. I'm not going to do a talk through. I'm going to do a voiceover. Um, so hopefully that works out well. If you guys don't like the voiceover, I can do a talk through next time. Um, I didn't do a full look at Ready With Me because I'm just literally throwing something on and I just threw my hair up. So it's just the makeup for today. Um, it is my every, every day, every night look. Every day look for a night going out um pretty simple just uh, foundation concealer all that fun stuff um i don't use primer normally unless it's like a huge event thing like prom or not that i'm in high school um hmm i don't know what other things do people go to a gala you know what i mean Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm apologizing for my tired red face prior to my makeup. Um, I don't have acne, but I do have redness and like dark circles. So um, I do enjoy putting makeup on. <laughs> if you guys haven't already, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. They will be linked below and they are also quick linked to my YouTube channel. So you can just click on that and it'll bring you right to my accounts, right to my pages, right to my, I'm not hip, I don't know. Whatever it is, it'll bring you there to follow or whatever. And if you haven't hit the notification bell um, or subscribed, please do so. And then you'll get notifications of when I upload. I feel like I forgot to say something. You hear that crying? It's my dog. He kind of, um, doesn't panic, but like, sometimes can't go up the stairs. He's like, almost three now. And he does it. He just did it. But he psychs himself out, so... <sighs> he cries. And he's gonna... Charlie, come here, babe. Come here. I run away. He ran away. He left me. I'm not looking at you. Okay, hi guys. So I first start off with my Pond's skin cream. It smells really good and it's very oily. So it's good for all dry skin types. But don't put too much because it'll just be very greasy. So I just dot it all over my face and rub it in.
All right, and then I grab my foundation, and it's actually the Maybelline Dream Liquid Mousse. I think it's so airbrushed looking. Um, they did change the uh, bottle, so it looks a little different from before, but that brush is upside down. I apologize. <laughs> but I just use a flat BH Cosmetics brush, and I just kind of go in circles and buff it around my face. Then I'm just going to go in with my concealer, and it's by Maybelline. It's the Master Conceal. And I actually usually get a lighter tone in this so that it also highlights as well. So I just go in with the same brush I use for my foundation and kind of just rub it under and on top of my eyelids. Then I just go in with my NYX setting spray. I got the dewy finish rather than the matte finish. And then I just spray that all over my face and kind of let it dry and let all the foundation and concealer set in. And now I'm going in with my Fit Me powder. So I just use this to set my foundation. And then I just take my fluffy brush and I kind of just buff it in all over my face. Okay, so here's my favorite part. I love bronzer. So I got this really big, I guess, palette pot of Revlon's bronzer. And I take my angled brush from BH Cosmetics and kind of just put it on my cheekbones, my temples, my jawline, my nose, anywhere I think needs it. Okay, so now I'm taking my fan brush from BH Cosmetics again, and my Nude Rose Sculpting Palette. So it's just bronzers and highlighters and all that fun stuff. Um, I do use the highlighter in this palette, as well as another one, but this is what I'm going to use for this video. It's pretty white and shimmery, but I thought it would go really well with this look. So I kind of just brush that along the top of my cheekbones and my nose and my cupid's bow. Okay, moving on to the eyebrows. I don't fill in my eyebrows. I don't um, put wax on them. I don't really do anything. I just kind of brush out all the excess foundation or anything that, any fallout that's on my eyebrows and make them the color that um, they really are. <laughs> so I kind of just brush them out, shape them like that, and I it's that simple. Next is my eyeshadow. This MAC eyeshadow is my favorite. I use this every single day. Um, I think it's called Omega. Yeah, it's called Omega. It's like kind of like a uh, taupey gray, green, brown, I guess. But it's my favorite, and I kind of just put them on my creases. Um, put them on my creases. Put it on my creases, and um, yeah. Very simple, very, very simple. OK, 
Okay, so now I'm just going in with my Tarte blush. It's, uh, I don't know what color it is, but it's pretty light. Very pigmented, so I don't put a lot. But I just put it on the apples on my cheeks. Okay, so I'm going to tell you a secret. I love wearing eyeliner, but I hate applying it. It's like the worst part of makeup for me. So, I normally do liquid on the top and make a wing and a pencil on the bottom. But for this video, I'm just going to kind of do liquid all over. Very, very thin and simple with a wing. Next, I'm going in with my favorite lip liner. Um, this specific lip liner um, is from, I think, Maybelline, again. But there's three shades that are very similar, and I feel like this one's just nude or something like that. But I usually just line my lips and kind of fill it in on the edges and then put lipstick on. But that varies every day. Okay, my favorite part, eyelashes. So the edges of, or the corners of my eyelashes, or my eye, where my eyelashes meet, they get tangled all the time. No, I do not have um, false eyelashes or extension, extensions or anything. These are my eyelashes, and, and they are pretty curly on their own. I'm honestly scared of eyelash curlers, so I don't use them even if I could. So yeah, I kind of have a trick to this. I put the mascara on the back of my eyelashes where I could have fallout from eyeshadow or powder or anything. So this kind of just blackens them more, makes them more bold and more thick and it lasts all day. Alright, so finally I'm just taking my MAC lipstick in Hue, and it's kind of like a nudie pink, my all-time favorite. It's my favorite. <laughs> um, I mainly just wear nudes, but this is probably the nicest nude I have ever seen. So now I'd like to just go in and do some touch-ups. And that is my completed look. Hope you guys liked it. I hope you enjoyed my video and I hope you liked this look. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video.